Nihal Ma. Hello, Gofna. Hello. Hi. So uh, I got my license yesterday. Woo! And uh, I got to enjoy my first uh, ride alone in the car today. Yeah. Yes. Which was extremely exciting. Put my iPod on shuffle and just like sang along to a bunch of songs. You know, like really badly and out of key, but whatever, it didn't matter because I was the only one in the car. My music selection is not what one would like classify as normal. Shuffle my iPod literally goes like Eminem, Lily Allen, Hello Dolly. Oh well it takes a woman, a female woman. Anyone? Anyone? No? Haven't seen that show? Anyway, that was exciting slash embarrassing because it's been a like probably three years since I think I've even sung anything. I used to be in choir in high school so like I used to actually sing and I stopped when I, you know, graduated and I, range has gone like from this to like near down to like a good five notes. And not always so on key. Embarrassing. But it doesn't matter because I was the only one in the car because I now have my license! Anyway, uh, I had an acting class today, or I started a new acting class. I'm taking an improv class and now I've started an acting class. For the what not, the what snits, natural. As with any uh, new like circumstance or you're meeting new people, people ask me, you know, hey, what do you do for a living? I'm never really sure what to say. Say. This time, uh, I said internet comedian, which is like, kind of true internet, yeah, comedian, eh. I think comedians are required to be funny, but, you know. It's like a really flattering, uh, uh job description for, a. Uh, you know. Anyway, let's just call it an innocent white lie. Anyway, I told someone I'm an internet comedian, they kind of hear it like, oh, that's cool. And then they say to their friend, oh, she's a comedian. And I'm like, oh, all right, we're getting a little bit further from the truth here. And then later someone comes up to me and they're like, hey, I heard you were a stand-up comedian. Me too. Where do you perform? Spiraling. Spiraling away from the truth right now. Uh, no, actually, I, I don't perform. I said you were a comedian. Yeah, I, I'm an internet comedian. See, I, I, I do, like, videos. Huh. It's hard to bounce back from something that's, like, kind of impressive to something that people have never heard of. I mean, when it comes from out of the blue, it's like, oh, cool, internet comedian. I don't know what that is. Awesome. But when people are like, hey, stand-up comedian, where can I see you perform? I don't actually do that. That's, uh, no, that's not what I do. Oh, stretching of the truth. How much trouble do you get me into? Actually, that's not, that's not so bad as far as, you know, um, a uh, white lie can get you. That's pretty okay because nothing, like, bad comes of it. Except for looking like a fool. Looking like a fool. Looking like a fool. That could be a rap. Do you guys ever like sing along to rap and like make it into a melody? Just me? Awesome. So my question for you is have you ever told like a white lie or like uh like just stretch the truth a little bit that seemed like harmless but it kind of spiraled out of control into something terrible? Tell me about it. That's actually a good one for video responses. Not that you have to. I just feel weird asking for video responses because it's a lot more work than a comment, but I'm going to stand on my toes now. Ha! Anyway, bye! See you later!